What's going on, comic fans? It is Mike from the Hardcover Comic here. Today, we're going to continue with my reread a thon. It is, of course, the year of custom binds, so I'm going to talk about a custom bind that I took the time to reread. Trying to get some reading done this year. I've got a whole bunch of books I need to get made, but one of the things I am trying to do this year is reread some of the books on my shelf. They've all been read at least once. I will say that. I don't think there's a book on there that I haven't read at least once. But I'm making my way through some books again, and today I wanted to talk about Umbrella Academy. This is going to be the first two series, um, the original and then Dallas. I'm uh, very excited to talk about these. There has, of course, been a third mini series, and there is currently, at the time of this recording, an ongoing series, sort of a spin off mini series called um, You Look Like Death Tales from the Umbrella Academy that focuses entirely on the character Klaus. Um, very cool stuff there. I'm really enjoying that. That might that will definitely be in another custom bind that we'll have to collect Hotel Oblivion. Um, before we get into that, though, if you're new to the channel, this is what we do. Overviews, reviews, re-reading, talking about top fives, top tens, upcoming projects, wish list things, a bunch of stuff, whatever Matt and I are in the mood to talk about that week. Um, so be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. If you've already subscribed and you're back again, welcome. Welcome. Nice to see you. Glad you're here. Check out our Patreon as well. For as little as a dollar a month, you get a chance to win a brand new hardcover comic, an omnibus absolute edition, uh, multiple deluxe editions. You know, we give away brand new books that have just come out as well. A lot of fun stuff happening there. You also get early access to these videos as early as seven days at times if I'm fast enough. Um, so check that out. Link down in the description below. We also do dust jacket designs, graphic cover designs if you're having your own custom binds made at Houchin. Um, and we also have merch. So if you're interested in that or just want to email us for fun our email is down in the description below the hardcover comic at gmail.com hit us up um, like i said dust jacket designs graphic cover designs merch all that fun stuff without further ado though let's get into the year of the custom binds rereading some custom binds umbrella academy <laughs> Now let's talk a little bit about Umbrella Academy. I've got my custom bind here. This collects, like I said, Apocalypse Suite and Dallas, the two first uh, miniseries stories arcs of Umbrella Academy. The first arc tells you about, you know, gets you introduced to the team and uh, Hargreaves. Essentially what happens, for those of you that are unaware, um, these first few pages tell you that on a particular day because of an atomic punch, 43 children were born inexplicably at the same time at the exact same second um, you know the, some others weren't even pregnant when it happened things like that really crazy situation um, and this Hargreaves gentleman picked up seven of those kids they're named numbers one through seven um, they do also have obviously full names and all that um, which you learn along the way not everyone but most of them do uh, so this is a really great story. I, I love the Umbrella Academy. It's a really great cast of characters that have been through very tumultuous times and are in a very peculiar and unique situation, both with their powers and with the situation they have at home and their family. You know, some of them have uh, physical deformities. Some of them are just, you know, um, they, they have certain things that their powers prevent them from being normal. Uh, it, of course, there has been a show. If you haven't been aware if you've been under a rock or you don't uh, have Netflix there is a show on Netflix with two seasons which essentially covered these first two arcs um, the first season sort of followed uh, the apocalypse suite arc for the most part and then the second season followed the Dallas arc what's really cool though is the show did make some pretty significant changes to the storylines because it's a TV show some things had to be modified in order to extend the length of the story because really these six issue stories in the comics they feel more like movies uh, they're a lot more compressed than the seasons of the TV show were, but they're still a really great story. It's kind of bizarre how much of a connection you get to these characters over the course of six issues. It's really fascinating, but Gerard Way is a great writer. I should say it's written by Gerard Way with uh, artwork by Gabriel Ba. Amazing, amazing creative team. There are library size, absolute size uh, hardcovers collecting these two minis along with Hotel Oblivion. I personally just didn't get those because I already had this bound. And uh, while I love Gabriel Ba's artwork, um, it's not, it's just, it's not one of those uh, stories right now for the moment. It's not one of those series that I feel the need to upgrade for. Um, I really like it though. Umbrella Academy is a series that I revisit frequently, it's quirky. 
Um, it's very weird. It's very um, out of the box. The characters, like I said, are really great. I've seen the show. I really like both. I like the differences between the two. It's great that you can watch the show, get an experience, and then go to the comic and get an experience as well. Personally, having reread this recently, it was really cool to you know, hear the voices of the actors in my head, um, actors and actresses, as I was reading this. Very, very cool stuff. Uh, this definitely is not a book for uh, for children, not at all. It's a very, very mature book. Um, but it looks cartoony. It looks cartoony, which sort of takes away from the uh, the seriousness of it all. I really like this. I'm really hoping that we get to see more of it. Um, there is a mini, like I said, sort of near the start of this video coming out now called You Look Like Death, Tales from the Umbrella Academy that follows Klaus, who is one of the characters here. Um, in the second storyline, Dallas, we saw them for a second there. You also get introduced to Hazel and Cha-Cha. They're a very fun duo in the Umbrella Academy universe. Um, Really crazy, really crazy duo. They also had a one-shot where they essentially save Christmas, which was a lot of fun. I think it was John Paul Leon who did the artwork on that one. Um, overall, I really like this franchise. I really do hope we get to see, keep seeing more. If the show continues to be successful, I imagine um, Gerard Way is going to continue writing comics, continue writing the show, and we'll get to see more of this awesomeness. We'll take a quick look at the binding here so I can you guys can see what a 12-issue bind looks like. I mean, zero gut, uh, there's a little bit of gutter loss because of the glued binding, but overall, I can't complain about this custom bind. I'm very excited for my next custom bind that's going to have Umbrella Academy Hotel Oblivion, the third mini in it. Um, I think I got the Hazel and Cha-Cha one-shot as well where they save Christmas. And then, of course, you look like Death Tales from the Umbrella Academy. I'm very excited for that. Have you guys read Umbrella Academy? Have you picked up those cool, nice, new, oversized Dark Horse Library Edition, Deluxe Editions, as they're calling them? Um, I, I had this. I would have upgraded, but, you know, I like the uh, I like the format I've got here. I, I'm a big fan of Gabriel Ba's artwork, like I said many times in the video, but I just can't justify double dipping or spending more money on oversized hardcover formats so let me know down in the description below what you thought about umbrella academy if you've seen the show let us know what you thought about it um check it out if you haven't seriously i love this series it's fantastic check out the show if you haven't it's great um and if you haven't be sure to subscribe this is what we do if you're new to the channel um we post multiple times a week reviews overviews we do live streams hauls all sorts of bunches all sorts of things it's a really fun time we do also have a patreon at the end of every month we give away hardcover comics um it could be a brand new omnibus brand new absolute multiple deluxe editions you decide whoever wins gets to decide for every dollar um you give you basically get an entrance into a drawing um so check that out link down in the description below if you're interested in dust jacket graphic cover designs um for your custom binds or your official omni or you just want some THC merch, hit us up at our email down in the description below. Thank you all very much for tuning in. This is Mike from the Hardcover Comic. Hope you guys are all doing well. Until next time, as always, you stay classy, Internet.